Yeah, so I'm saying that it is a red day to me. One, I am in red, and uh, my mom in the Lord is also in red. Red has always been considered to be a bad, a bad thing or a bad, a bad man. But red is love. Okay, red is love. <laughs> so red is love, and so to me, red is a uh, is an abbreviation of these these words. Remember what the Lord God has done in your life. Evaluate. And D stands for decide. So we are in a day of deciding towards what we have seen and felt from the Lord God. Uh, we are here to do a video shooting for CISO. CISO is a new word. And so CISO is strong desire. But the song Siso is Siso Olo Yagidala. Siso Olo Yagidala is a strong desire for eternity. And the song Siso Olo Yagidala was composed by me. And I remember that when I was doing the composition, I went through my Bible. And in the Bible, I read the book of Psalms 63, verse 1 to 11. And Psalms 43, verse 1 to 11. This was a time that uh, David, the king, was living in a lonely situation. The environment was not conducive for him. And so David decided that the only person that he can face was God. And so David said that how much do I desire to be closer to you? The song Siso has four stanzas. The first one is where I had put the Psalms 43 and 63. The second stanza of Siso is Kaparo Dalasayun. Kaparo Dalasayun. Remembering all that I've gone through and having the wise says of my grandmother who took care of me when my mother passed on, we spoke, we had a deep fellowship with her. And so what is done in the second stanza of Siso were the wise sayings of my grandmother. Members, all those who will be viewing this and hearing this, uh, that stanza is all about putting your whole you are whole into the Lord, surrendering yourself fully to the Lord, knowing that all that we see on this earth, all that we touch, one time they sh we shall leave them as we get to our Lord. The third stanza of Siso is I heard that voice the same way Paul heard the voice calling him. So, so, why thou persecuted me? And so Paul had this soul, as soul he had this. And in transformation, he was transformed inwardly and transformed outwardly to have the name Paul in existence. We thank the Lord for that answer, that Paul responded positively towards the call and so he was called a new name. The fourth stanza of Siso is Anaduaro Teko Teko Maliko Unyesu. How I need the power, power from you, Lord, to overcome the raging battles that we have in life. And so I derived this, this stanza 
from the book of Gospel, Gospel according to St. John, chapter 1, verse 11 and 12. John, chapter 1, verse 11 to 12. We say that Jesus came to his own, but then his own rejected him. But to all who received him, he gave them power to become his children. And so that is where the last stanza came from. I thank the Lord that it has gone that far. This song has been done in many, many languages. And so I've done it in Kiswahili. I've done it in uh, English, Uganda. Recently, I did it in Kimasai. And because of the love for the Maasai language, let me say that another narrative called the Maasai is Kaiyeu Engolon. Allow me to say that uh, so has gone that far, and this is the day that I want to thank God for giving me this great opportunity uh, once again to be with my, my mom and uh, my friend. <laughs> My sister in Christ, uh, the Lord God connected us through this, and we have moved a long way, embracing and promoting so. Uh, this day, Mom, I want to thank the Lord. Being with you here reminds me of a great saying that has continued in the East African Bible Fellowship that you tell uh, which has been continuing, and so the word is Kirenu Fukiwia from Atibu Kite. This day, um, our total is up to three, and it is by the grace of God that I can sit next to the Father. Baba, I thank you so much for the far that the Lord God has brought us and how you have embraced Siso and embrace the owner of CISO, but may the good God bless you. Mm -hmm. I remember that even when you are, uh, we started, she was a great encouragement to the song. At the same time, when, when we were launching the song, Mama came all the way from South Africa to come and grace the occasion. And so this song has touched many souls. Mama, thank you. And so, can we have this opportunity to say something about CISO and even about your son? So, thank you very much. Um, as SS says, SS is so sad. As he says, he's come a long way and he has composed this song. Siso Oloya Gitano. Siso Oloya is, I would call it a revival song because it reminds us of so many things. It reminds us of the urge to praise God in earnest, to think of ourselves, to hope for things to come, to work hard knowing that better things are coming. Anybody who needs to go to school is going nowhere. And when you are hoping for things, you don't sit back and wait for things to come. You work towards us. I know God provides. God provides me for birds in the air, but not in their nest. That bird must get out, but go for the food and feed itself and feed the next things. So that is how we go so this. I'm glad that this is a song is coming up in many languages. That's a very good way because you are sharing it with many people who see the beauty of God, the beauty of salvation, and the beauty of the song. I enjoy this song so much. In my quiet time, I played until night has become a pattern. In fact, 
I share it all the time with my friends. And I pray that let, let it lead us to the best destination that we are looking for. That it brings a vision and the life to come. It prepares us for the life to come. In Jesus. So that you don't say, ah, I started the journey and I've been somewhere on the way. We walk right up to a destination. And particularly this time, this time that the world has given so many diseases, we have this COVID-19 here in Kenya. Now you see somebody, now they are gone. They are here, now they are gone. We must be careful, even as we celebrate and enjoy the celebration of this life. We must be careful. And all of these protocols, I know that right now I'm talking about the mask, but I'm keeping my distance from my brother, that's it. But as all of the protocols that have been laid down, wear the mask, keep our distance, wash our hands often, and thank God that we are alive and pray that this thing is the bad air that is going to pass through our prayers. Thank you. 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 Thank so, oh no, I just log in and you'll find it. And I'm sure you'll enjoy it. And make it be a part of your life.